Hi, this is Dr. Libby at Implant Center of Miami in Bay Harbor. I just wanted to answer a very common question that we get, which is why do I need a bone graft after I get a tooth pulled? So let me explain things to you. We are Implant Center of Miami. We place implants all day long, every day. Um, so when you're coming to us, you're coming to get your tooth replaced. Now, when we extract a tooth, it leaves a hole in the gums, right? And eventually we want to put a screw in that hole to replace the roots of your tooth that, were, that was just taken out. How am I going to put a screw in there that's going to be nice and tight in the bone if there is no bone? So a bone graft, the type of bone graft that we use is also a big question that we get is what type, is cadaver bone. Um, which is the most compatible with the human body because it is human bone. So it's dried, ground up into a powder. We mix it with saline. It has a consistency of wet sand. Sometimes we mix it with your with um, plasma that we get from your own blood. So some PRF is something that we do. We draw your blood, spin it in a centrifuge, mix the, the growth factors with the bone graft. It, create, it makes for an amazing healing process. And uh, we put that in the hole at the same time as we do the extraction. And then a few months later, you're ready for an implant. If you wanna take the risk of, of not doing the bone graft, then what could happen is that because there's no reason for bone to be there anymore without a tooth, the bone might never fill in. And you might be left with a site that's no long, that, that you might no longer be a candidate for an implant. So if you're ever thinking that you may or may not wanna replace a tooth, Always err on the, on the safe side and get that bone graph when you get your extraction. Hope this was informative.